Crota's return to destiny, or at least little baby wannabe mini-me Crota. This week's Court of Oryx boss, you drop an antiquated rune. It's really not too bad of a fight. There's just going to be some annoying taken phalanx that you got to get rid of. And I would suggest taking out the wizards possibly first and then worrying about the phalanx. And if there's other people here like this, I, I just wouldn't trust anybody. If you have a buddy in your little group that's good at running sword, have them be aware of what the knight's health is at so they can grab sword because we tried this with like four people and there was one random and he kept killing the knight super early and taking his sword. So I made sure to just hover by the sword so nobody else could take it because I just, you're not sure if people are year one destiny players or they're year two. Maybe a lot of people haven't done the Crota fight and they don't really understand the mechanics. But it's really not that hard if you have multiple people. We did it with three people and then three more guys showed up. And I mean, this thing's a piece of cake with six people. It was pretty fun to bang on little mini-me baby Crota. I'm sure Bungie, they realized how big of a joke Crota was and his raid was. I mean, you see there, you can almost kill him in one sword. I think I'm 297 light in this video. But the fight overall is really not that bad. And you see there's going to be a delayed wave until a new knight comes in, a sword bearer knight. So just focus on the wizards, take out the phalanx, and hunters, if you have a year two, Celestial Nighthawk, put that bad boy on. You could probably take about 90 to 95% of his shield down, depending on your light. If you're above 300, you might be able to take his whole shield down. Warlock stuck Crota with some fusion grenades. You know, Sunsinger, pop your super and just start lobbing aids at him. That will help from keeping his shield to reach in. We had some people on my team, or my two friends, using Truth, but Truth friggin' blows, dude. I forgot how much that thing sucks. You'll probably be better off with a high-impact machine gun over Truth. That thing sucks. And we actually uh, did it in under two minutes, so I got to finish this Challenge of the Court bounty. And we will go and turn this into Eris, and you can see the rewards. Nothing too spectacular. She's just gonna hook you up with an artifact, though, 300 artifact, which was really nice because my artifact was only, I think, 292 something like that before that and then she's also going to hook you up with a shader that looks ass ugly you look at this autumn splendor it's like a i don't even know it's like a denver broncos mixed with luke skywalker's jumpsuit from star wars his little uh, pilot suit this shader blows but anyway have a good one guys see ya